an island of magic, Voodoo dolls, potion making, and different kinds of healing oils made of weird ingredients like plant leaves, roots, or insects, welcome to Sikihor Island. It is located in the central Visayas region and is the third smallest province in the Philippines. Dati itong sub-province ng Negros Oriental at naging independent province noong 1971. At dati itong tinatawag na Island of Fire at nakilala sa mga mystic traditions magpasa hanggang ngayon. Kamusta mga kalakotseros? Let us explore the mystic island of Sikihor. Budget, guide, and activities ang ating tatalakayin sa travel video na ito. Kaya stay tuned. Ang pinakamadaling jump off point ay magmula sa Dumaguete kung saan you have several options ng mga ferry boat going to Sikihor Island as early as 7am up to 4pm and the fare ranges from 120 to 130 pesos and it will take you 45 minutes bago marating ang Sikihor Island. Once you are in a Sikihor, meron kayong dalawang options sa tour. It can be the mountain tour or the most easiest, the land tour. Kung gusto nyo namang gawin both the mountain and land tour, maglaan ng dalawang araw para matapos ito. You have four options to explore the island. It can be via multicab, van, tricycle or motorcycle. And the most famous and easiest way are the tricycle or motorcycle. If you are on a solo or group of two, I would suggest you take the motorcycle. Make sure you have a driver license. And if you are in a group of three to four packs, better to take the tricycle. And mostly the tricycle driver will serve as your tour guide. In my case, since I don't have a driver license, I took the tricycle tour for only 1,000 pesos. I would suggest to contact my tricycle driver na si Kuya Richard. His contact number can be found in the description box below. Let us now start the tour. First stop, the I Love Sikihor signage. This is just 4 minutes away from the port. Next, another 14 minutes away is the Little Boracay of Sikihor, the Palitun Beach. It is dubbed as the Little Boracay dahil na rin sa pinong buhangin nito na mahalin tulad ng sa Boracay. Best path there is the coconut tree leaning to the beach side towards the ocean. There are no entrance fee here. Just your will to give donations sa mga taong mag assist sa inyo at kukuha ng mga Instagrammable photos nyo.
24 minutes away from Paliton Beach is the century-old Balete Tree. Ang pwede niyang gawin doon ay magpa-fish foot spa. Entrance fee is only 10 pesos. And from there, pwede na rin kayong bumili ng mga souvenir items dahil merong mga tindahan ng mga souvenirs just beside the Balete Tree. At pwede na rin magmerienda. Going up north for another 14 minutes, heading to the municipality of Lassi is the oldest Roman Catholic church in the island, the San Isidro Labrador Parish Church, or commonly known as Lassi Church, founded in 1857. And just in front of the church is the huge convent. Entrance fee is 20 pesos, and it was nominated for UNESCO World Heritage in 2006. naman kalayuan in just 4 minutes away is the famous Kambugahay Falls. Nakilala ito dahil sa napakagandang view nito na merong 3-layered waterfalls at malagetorate blue na kulay ng tubig nito. At hindi lang yon. aside from swimming, e eh pwede ka ring tumalon mula sa platforms na gawa ng mga locals. Entrance fee is 10 pesos. And if you want to swim and you want to make sure na safe ka, pwede rin namang mag ng life vest sa halagang 100 pesos. And if you want to jump from the platform, you need to pay 20 pesos. That is unlimited use of the platform. Well, of course, they will provide you with a guide who will serve as your photographer as well. No fixed rate for the guide, you just have to give them donations or tips. After you enjoy the enchanting Kambugahay Falls, it's time to proceed to the next stop, the Salagduong Beach. It is another 25 minutes ride from Kambugahay Falls. Entrance fee is 55 pesos. Swimming and jump on the cliff jumping platform ang mga activities na pwedeng gawin dito mga kalakwacheros.
Other attractions along the Siki Horse Circumferential Road are the following Witchcraft Pictorial, Famous Coco Bread, or the Mangrove Trees. That's all for now mga kalokacharos. Let me know which part of the video you like most and leave a comment below. Give it a thumbs up at i-share mo na rin. And do not forget to subscribe mga kalokacharos and click that notification bell para kasama ka na sa next lakwacha natin. Next stop, let's explore Siargao Island. Hanggang sa muli nating pagkikita mga kalokacharos. Bye! Peace!